Hello viewers, welcome back to our channel. Kindly subscribe, comment, like, and also share. Well, 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 this is amazing. Prince Harry, our favorite Duke, is out in these street with the big dogs. One minute he's at the UN, the next he's addressing NATO. We love a booked and busy prince. Advocating for active and disabled military service personnel will always be a cause close to he has heart. This reality cast a long shadow over Harry's life, influencing his every move and decision. Harry navigated a childhood of privilege, but it was also filled with intense scrutiny. Every action, every word was analyzed by the public and the media. The world watched his every move, often with a critical eye, making it difficult for him to find his own path. Despite the challenges, Harry's playful spirit shone through. He found joy in simple moments, often displaying a mischievous grin. He shared a close bond with his mother, Princess Diana. She was his confidant and his source of comfort. Her warmth and compassion left an indelible mark on him, shaping his character and values. She instilled in him a deep sense of empathy for others, teaching him the importance of kindness and service. This would later become a defining characteristic of Harry's life, guiding his actions and decisions. Harry's teenage years were marked by both joy and tragedy. He excelled in sports, finding solace and camaraderie on the field. He developed a passion for Africa, a continent that would become a significant part of his life and work. However, the tragic death of his mother in 1997 shook him profoundly. It was a loss that he would carry with him forever. He grappled with grief and loss in the public eye, a burden that few can truly understand. This experience shaped his worldview, making him more resilient and determined to honor his mother's legacy. It ignited a desire to make a difference in the world, to use his platform for good and to help those in need. As Harry matured, his royal duties intensified. He found himself increasingly in the public eye, representing the monarchy at various events and ceremonies. He participated in numerous public engagements, tirelessly supporting charitable causes close to his heart. From raising awareness to fundraising, he was deeply involved. Yet, despite his active involvement, he felt a growing sense of restlessness. There was an inner calling that he couldn't ignore, a desire for something more meaningful. He yearned for a more hands-on role, one where he could make a tangible difference. He wanted to be on the ground, directly impacting lives. He wanted his life to have a greater purpose beyond the confines of tradition and royal expectations. He sought a path that resonated with his personal values and aspirations. His military service became a turning point in his quest for purpose. The discipline, camaraderie and challenges of military life offered him a new perspective. He served two tours in Afghanistan, where he faced the harsh realities of war. This experience was both humbling and eye-opening. This experience had a profound impact on him. He saw the complexities of conflict and the human cost of war up close. He witnessed the realities of war firsthand, from the chaos of the battlefield to the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity. He formed deep bonds with his fellow soldiers, relationships forged in the crucible of shared hardship and mutual respect. He discovered a sense of camaraderie and purpose he hadn't found elsewhere. The military community became a second family to him. The military instilled in Harry a deep respect for service and sacrifice. He learned the true meaning of duty and honor. He saw the devastating effects of conflict, the physical and emotional scars left on soldiers and civilians alike. He also witnessed the resilience of the human spirit, the strength and determination of those who had suffered but continued to fight for a better future. This experience fueled his desire to support veterans. He became a passionate advocate for their rights and well-being. It also ignited a passion for advocating for peace and understanding. He dedicated himself to promoting global harmony and supporting those affected by conflict. After leaving the military, Harry sought new ways to make a difference. He began to speak out on issues close to his heart. Mental health awareness became a particular focus. He shared his own struggles publicly. He encouraged others to seek help. Harry's willingness to be vulnerable resonated with people worldwide. He challenged the stigma surrounding mental health. He became a powerful advocate for open conversations. His platform grew. He used it to amplify the voices of others. He traveled extensively, engaging with communities around the globe. He met with leaders and activists. He listened to their stories. He learned about their challenges. This first-hand experience deepened his understanding of global issues. It fueled his determination to be a force for positive change. In 2021, Prince Harry delivered a powerful speech at the United Nations, 
he spoke passionately about climate change. He called for urgent action to address this global crisis. He urged world leaders to prioritize the planet's future. His words resonated with millions. He spoke not just as a prince, but as a concerned citizen of the world. He highlighted the interconnectedness of global issues. He emphasized the need for collective action. His speech was a call to arms. It urged everyone to play their part in creating a more sustainable future. Prince Harry's advocacy extended beyond environmental concerns. He also became a vocal supporter of vulnerable populations. He spoke at the NATO summit in 2022. He addressed the plight of refugees and displaced persons. He called for greater compassion and support for those fleeing conflict and persecution. He shared stories of resilience and hope. He urged world leaders to prioritize humanitarian aid and resettlement efforts. His speech was a powerful reminder of our shared humanity. Throughout his journey, Prince Harry's commitment to military personnel remained unwavering. He founded the Invictus Games. This international sporting event provides a platform for wounded, injured and sick servicemen and women. The Invictus Games celebrate the indomitable spirit of these athletes. They showcase the power of sport in healing and rehabilitation. Harry's dedication to the Games is a testament to his deep respect for the sacrifices made by service members. He continues to advocate for veterans' mental health. He raises awareness about the challenges they face upon returning home. He works tirelessly to ensure they receive the support and resources they deserve. It came after years of growing disillusionment with the British tabloid press. The relentless intrusion into his life took a toll on his mental health. He and his wife, Meghan Markle, faced intense scrutiny and criticism. They were subjected to racist and hateful attacks. The lack of support from the royal institution compounded their pain. Ultimately, they chose to prioritize their well-being and build a new life away from the spotlight. Leaving royal life was a courageous act. It allowed Harry to redefine himself on his own terms. He embraced his newfound freedom. He dedicated himself fully to the causes he was passionate about. He became a vocal advocate for mental health awareness. He spoke openly about his own experiences with therapy. He encouraged others to seek help without shame. He used his platform to challenge societal stigmas. He and Meghan moved to California, where they established Archwell, their non-profit organization. Through Archwell, they continue to champion causes close to their hearts. They focus on mental health, gender equality, and climate change. Section 9. Archwell Foundation – A Platform for Compassion the Archerwell Foundation serves as a vehicle for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's philanthropic endeavours. It reflects their shared values of compassion, empathy, and social justice. They use their platform to amplify the voices of marginalised communities. They partner with organisations working on the front lines of social change. They support initiatives that promote mental well-being, empower women and girls, and address systemic racism. Their work through Archerwell demonstrates their commitment to creating a more just and equitable world. Section 10. The Invictus Games – Empowering Wounded Warriors The Invictus Games remain a cornerstone of Prince Harry's legacy. He continues to champion the Games, which have grown in scope and impact since their inception. Athletes from around the world compete in various adaptive sports, showcasing their resilience and determination. The Games provide a platform for these wounded warriors to connect, heal, and rediscover their strength. They foster a sense of camaraderie and support, reminding participants that they are not alone in their journeys. Harry's unwavering dedication to the Invictus Games reflects his deep respect for the sacrifices made by service members and their families. Section 11. A Legacy Beyond Royalty, Prince Harry's Enduring Impact Prince Harry's journey has been one of transformation and growth, marked by significant milestones and personal evolution. From his early days as the spare to his evolution into a global advocate, he has come.